Hi miners, I have some news about the Terra farm. The creator is back, he tried to finish the mod. So I hope uh, in the future we have uh, the final version. For the record, I will show you today how you can add new machines in the Terra farm. Today we will add the modhub John Deere 50G. We need to download the mod. Next, go in my website, Terraform News. And get the final version. We have the Terraform, we have the mod, so we unzip, I will unzip the 50G because I want to change the controls too, so first I think I think she has fixed it okay we will see the game so drop the VTG in your mod folder extract the terraform drop in your mod folder now open the terraform go to XML configurations, open the FSM or here. Okay, outside outside of the of the folders in that one, Yammer dig bucket uh, duplicate. We'll uh, rename at JD fifty bucket. Next we copy all that one. Go in the index, go down here. Duplicate that one and paste the name here. Save. We have done with that. Now we open the new folder we see here some informations so here we must put the mod name go back in the folder the name is FS22 John Deere 50G paste here next we open the folder and need the bucket XML also open that one we put here the XML name and here we need the type name that one shovel Okay. Now, uh, here we must put the node we need to be the terraform. I select the pickup node. I find it more easy because it is in the front of the shovel. So I paste here that one. I delete those offsets because we need the node. The node it is on the right position. Save. 
Now we must open the bucket in the giant editor. Create a node, a transform, control X, go find the pickup node here. It is in the with the shovel visibility and check the dimensions of the bucket. We need something like that so copy that and put here we are almost on the same so we will change only the last uh, number i will delete that offset i think no need careful and it is done close that one not save uh, we are done now open the game we are in the game by the excavator by the shovel Need some more changes. Bucket have the apartment you can see. Lower, enable. Then Okay, uh, please don't uh, start the question what uh, you do and what how you do and how to add that machine that I show you exactly what you must do it is very simple don't forget to add the new XML in the index that is um, the problem that most people don't know uh, to add the new XML here in the index XML and next it is very easy you open here I think I have the most of them for example we have here and a roller rod compactor 
the mod it is the XMLs are the same XML name here type of the of the mod what type it, it is that one vehicle type and the mod the mod folder name here if uh, you want any extra distance you put those here if you not you delete them okay we have here is uh, we loaders the blade for the dozers uh, the graders the reapers and be careful uh, what uh, node you choose I suggest you, you choose the lower the node it is nearest at the point and add that one if the mod if the mod did not have uh, i3d mapping you must put here uh, numbers the numbers wait to show you Okay, I know many people will uh, try to we have start to ask below in the comments. Uh, if the mod, if the mod did not have uh, i three i three D mapping, because some mods did not have. something like that to select uh, to select the ID and not the node you must put those numbers the index path here oops copy here you must put uh, the index path okay That was the video, very very easy. Uh, I hope we have the final version of Terraform the next month and uh, do the modders the rest. So the bad thing is I must uh, redo the most of the, my mods. But uh, after that will be more easy for the motors and the people to add new machines. So, support my effort with a free like. If you are new and you like the content, subscribe. If you have any question, <laughs> leave a comment. Thank you for watching, bye bye.